Hello everyone and welcome to SpatialPost.com. In this video, we will see, a basic overview of Google Earth Pro. If you like to learn more about the Google Earth, you can check my other videos. After you have installed the Google Earth, you will be presented with this screen. You have the beautiful Earth in front of you. First I want to clarify that the images used in Google Earth, are not live images, they are usually between 1 to 3 years old. So, first we will look at navigations. You can see a hand is visible on the screen. By clicking and dragging, it will navigate to the left side. You can just drag it, in any direction you like. You can just give it a pull to navigate the earth. The top right corner has a series of tools. You can also use the compass tool to navigate, and rotate the earth surface. You can use the move tool, down below to rotate the earth surface. Finally, we have the zoom in and zoom out tool below the move tool. You can zoom in. And zoom out the location you are looking at. You can do the same thing with your mouse using the scroll button by doing scroll in and scroll out into an area. You can also double click the left mouse button to zoom into a particular area. And by double clicking the right mouse button, it will zoom out the location. Upper left hand side of your screen, here is the search box, you can type in the place name and it will take you immediately to that location. You can see when it zoom in, it starts out blurry and depending on the speed of your internet connection, the clear picture will appear. You can type names of country, city, place or any address that you know and it will find the location for you and zoom it on the screen. So, use the search engine to quickly find the location, that you are looking for. Then we have, the layers, layers lets you overlay the different kind of information on your location or area, it includes road, water feature, weather, labels and many more. So when I add the border layer, it will display the border and labels on the screen, when I click places, then we start getting the names of cities, town and area names. And clicking on photos, we will be getting all these small dots and while clicking on these icons you will see the different photos. By enabling the road layer, all the street name will be displayed to user. There are lots of layer available in Google Earth and you can use these layers as per your requirements. You can also check the terrain of an area, just type the location name. And it will take you to that place. Click the left mouse button and tilt the view to get the 3D view. At the bottom right corner, it will display the latitude, and the longitude values of your current location. Aside this, it will also display elevation and altitude values. We have one more tool in Google Earth that is Street View. 
to use this tool you need to click on this gentleman and drag it on the earth's surface. Now it can display interactive images in 360 view. You can exit this view by clicking exit button on top right corner. You can also check 3D view of an area by enabling the 3D building layer. 3D images will start rendering the view. You can zoom to the structure and view the structure. Now let's see some of the basic tools available in Google Earth. These tools are very useful while working on Google Earth. First one is Add Placemark tool. While clicking on this tool it will display a small window, you can adjust the placemark according to your need, and it will capture the latitude and longitude accordingly. You can add description and change label and color. Second one is Add Polygon. You can create an area or polygon on the surface and change its attributes accordingly. Then we have the path tool. You can create line or path on the surface and can also measure its length on appropriate units. By using historical images tool, you can view old images of an area, this will be helpful if you want to see the changes occurs on particular area. Google Earth application also allow us to check sky, Mars and moon details by using this tool. Then we have the show ruler tool which allows you to measure the line, path, area or the area of a circle on the ground. Save image tools allows you to save the current view of Google Earth as an image. Please make sure you like this video, subscribe spatialpost.com YouTube channel and share this on social media. Visit spatialpost.com for more details.